Hello everyone, welcome to Lisa Horton Crafts. My name is Natalia. Today I will show you how I made a shaker card using new 30 edges dies. I'm creating inky background. I'm using squeezed lemonade ink and adding inks with a little bit of water to acetate. And adding this uh, ink to the card. I'm cleaning the acetate in between and adding another ink, Twisted Citron and adding to the card. So I'm trying not to use too much water uh, because I'm using just 250 GSM card. I'm using a speckled egg ink now and adding to the card. I'm creating inky, messy background. Here I already die cut the floral panel and I'm just uh, looking how it will look. So I've decided to add a more a twisted citron and I'm adding to the card. I um, made more inky background using the same technique and here I'm just showing I'm using a little bit of a um, bottle mixed with water and mica powders for a little bit of shine. I'm drying the background with the heat gun. You can see a little bit of shine. So here I'm using some frame dies from Mini Slime Collection, Swirling Daisy. And I'm using the second uh, largest one and I cut the floral panel. I'm using two of the frame dies um, to die cut little frame from blue color card, which I will adhere to the floral panel. So now I will uh, cut out the uh, inky background slightly smaller than the base card, uh, which is 5 by 7 So I'm cutting the inky background. I'm adhering the inky background to the card with wet glue. And here is my floral panel. Cutting the acetate smaller than the uh, floral panel. I'm using um, red tape and adding to the back of this uh, floral panel. I'm using my pocket tool to release the back of the uh, red tape. And I'm, I'm adhering the acetate to the back. So here I'm adding 3D foam tape to the back 
all the way around. And here I'm adding more 3D foam uh, pass to the center of the flowers. And now I will add a little frame to the um, panel. I'm using a mermaid tails um, glitter and some sequins. So because I've got some uh, 3D foam pass at the back of the center of the flowers, I'm just trying to remove the sequins away so I can easier to glue, um, I can adhere the panel. I'm adhering the panel to the cut. So here are the sticker sentiments and silver color. So I've used the sentiment uh, hugs and kisses. And I'm adhering the sentiment to the blue color card and I'm cutting all the way around. And now I will adhere the sentiment with the wet glue to the cup. So here I'm adhering, I'm adding some sequins uh, to the front of the card. Here is the shaker card. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to hit the notification bell for more video tutorials. Take care. Bye.